In this video, we'll be going over linking charts by instrument. As we all know, chart linking is a powerful feature that enables us to apply an action to a set of charts at the same time instead of a single chart at a time. So by default, the charts are all unlinked and we can assign linking via the drop-down in the toolbar. We can either link all or assign a specific group link by color. And we can also do that via the blue status bar here in the bottom left-hand corner. We can either link all or we can pick a specific colored link. So let's go on over to configure preferences. And on the second row, we'll click on linking. Now there are three different modes for linking within Motive Wave. In this video, we are going to focus only on the instrument linking, but there's also bar size and none, and those are covered in other videos. So at the moment, as we can see, link all, as well as all the colored links are set to instrument. So let's click OK. Now at the moment, you'll notice that none of the charts are linked, and I can verify that. So if I were to, for instance, click on my watch list, and my watch list is linked here, it will only change the chart for the selected chart and not all four of them. Now if I assign a specific link, so let's uh, select red for all these charts here, red, red, and red. You'll notice now, if I change symbols, all the instruments here will sync up. At the moment, they're all set to dollar yen, dollar Swiss, and dollar cat. Now, this is a powerful feature which allows you to take a look at a specific instrument on multiple time frames without having to change a time frame. All you need to do is just simply change a symbol and you can get your different views. So in this case, we have a daily time frame, a six hour time frame, a 15 minute time frame, and a five minute time frame. Now, along with using a watch list, you can also use a drop down to change symbols. You can also type in your symbol. Other windows such as the DOM and time and sales windows can also be given a link group. So let's bring up a DOM window. So here we can assign red. I'll just make this small, put it here. We can also do a time and sales window. And we'll also make this small, we'll assign this red. Now, if I change symbols either on the DOM or on the time and sales, you'll notice that anything linked with red in this case will also change to the same symbol. We also have link all. If you're working with the console window or a desktop, there's an additional linking component called link all. And that's available again from the drop down here or in the bottom left hand corner in the status bar. Now, linking all only applies to the charts on that specific page. It does not apply to any of the DOM or time and sales windows, in this case, outside of the console. So you can see now that all these four charts are linked by the link icon right next to the left of the symbol. And if I unlink all, then they will all be unlinked. Okay, so that's it for this video, and we'll see you in the next.